All right, take two. Here we go. We're going to talk a little bit today about uh, fall cleanup. As you can see, some things suffered here in good old Oklahoma. Usually those suckers are troopers. But the 115 degree weather didn't really help them out at all. Plus, you know, $15 a week was not incentive enough for my children to water for me. This here is my dynamite crepe myrtle. Look at how sad her is. See those saggy little leaves? Poor little baby. She'll get some water later, don't worry. So let's move on to the devastation that is my garden. Dun, dun, dun. Holy shit. Not looking so great. Gonna need some cleanup. So, when you have something like this, isn't that gorgeous? There are things you can do that will uh, not waste their little lives, for lack of a better way to put it. You want to remove these tags. Like so. And no worries, I got all that crap for free. So, these were all discards disadvantage from the beginning of our relationship. Probably in reflection, they will wish that they had not come here. <laughs> <clears throat> so anyway, what we're going to do with this stuff is conserve it. Pardon the camera. You know, I, I just got two hands here and one has a camera. So, we pick off the dead business. How am I going to all right, I'm going to shake the dirt out, keep all that stuff together, and if you're not an experienced gardener, that is when these little tags here have a purpose. When you like something that you picked for the year, keep it in your kitchen drawer, not the ground. Okay, so here we have this little plant, poor little guy. But we're not going to waste them by throwing them in the trash bag. What we're going to do is push all this up and conserve. This is free food. All these plants hold or have plant-ready nutrients that you can then use again. The thing I hate the most about fall is uh, seeing huge bags of leaves waiting on the trash guys to come and get them. Way to fertilize the dump. Okay, so, since this is just kind of a trial little thing, see how this works out. Might go over better than, you know, writing five pages of stuff nobody's going to read. So, we shall revisit all this again. Maybe when I figure out a better plan for the camera. <laughs> Poor little babies. But at least when they go, they'll be making another plant's life that much richer. Isn't it warm and fuzzy? I feel like I need to change my sweater and my shoes and sing a song about the neighbors. Alright, well. Test one complete. Mousy, what did you think? Did you like it? Mousy cat. What did you think? Okay, well, the end. I'll see you next time, I hope. Bye-bye.